105, our community banks of Colorado camera is showing you that shot. High pressure is in control across the Intermountain West. That gives way to a lot of sinking air, which means we get these clear skies, these warm days, or what we should call seasonal afternoons. Compared to where we were late last week, down in the deep freeze, this feels like a heat wave in some areas. Notice, though, we've got another cold front coming across the Pacific Northwest. The Juno, Alaska, parts of the Gulf of Alaska, so still a ways off. It's really not going to be sweeping across the state of Colorado until Thursday. So right on Thanksgiving Day, we are going to endure a little bit of a cool down, but it won't be too significant. Until then, enjoy these seasonal temperatures, highs in the 40s and 50s across the Pikes Peak region and near 60 degrees across portions of the eastern plains. We are still high and dry as we move through Tuesday. Mix the sun and clouds for Tuesday afternoon, but you'll be waking up with ample sunshine it's just by the afternoon time frame. We'll have a bit of a, a period of clouds and a period of sun across the region. Temperatures overnight Tuesday into Wednesday will go down into the 20s once again, so it's really just a rinse and repeat setup until about Thursday. Notice tonight we go down to about 24 degrees for Colorado Springs just before sunrise tomorrow morning, so fairly average for this time of year. Average high is about 51 degrees, and we'll be back close to that for tomorrow. But notice these temperatures across the Pikes Peak region for this evening. 19 degrees in Hanover, Fountain and Fort Carson at 19 degrees, 20 degrees in Woodland Park. As we expand the view here, you'll notice we're still sub-zero across the San Luis Valley. Tomorrow, sunny, temperatures in the 40s and 50s. Boy, it's going to be a gorgeous day. If you have the day off, get out, enjoy it, do a little Manitou incline, you know, try to get that heart rate up before we all commit gluttony completely on Thursday and just overstuff ourselves, right? It's that time of year. Tis the season. Turkey's happy about it. Temperatures will be back up into the 40s on Thanksgiving Day, so it is going to be a good 10 to 12 degrees cooler on Thanksgiving Day. Black Friday, though, we warm back up into the 50s, so we're going to rebound very quickly and warm back up Friday and even heading into the upcoming weekends. Notice here your monument seven day forecast showing those temperatures at about 51 degrees on Tuesday and then down to the 40s Wednesday and then just above freezing for Thanksgiving Day for monument. Overnight lows will really hover in the teens and 20s for the next several consecutive nights. Woodland Park, 48 degrees for Tuesday, a little bit more cloud cover Wednesday. Hovering just around freezing for Thursday, and we've got a high of about 41 degrees for Thanksgiving Day. A little, a little guy's not so sure about it, but he's looking around, just wondering what his fate is. I don't know. Temperatures back up into the 50s and 60s for the start of the upcoming weekends. Pueblo, 56 degrees on Tuesday, 59 Wednesday, and a lot cooler as we make our way into Thanksgiving Day for all of our zones, and nice and warm for the weekend. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Turn your car into cash at Mike Maroney, regardless.